Distillation is a separation technique that separates compounds on the basis of their boiling points. First, a round bottom flask is clamped to one ring stand. The flask must be large enough that the solution does not take up more than half the flask. A stir bar, or boiling stone, is added next. Here, you can see one single boiling stone. The solution to be distilled is added after that. Once the solution has been added, a three-way adapter is attached to the round bottom flask. Notice that no keck clip is added as the high heat of the distilling vapor can melt it. On a separate ring stand, clamp the condenser sideways. A vacuum adapter is attached to the lower end of the condenser with a keck clip. Ensure the openings of the condenser are pointing up. Move the ring stands together in order to connect the three-way adapter with the condenser. Secure the connection with a keck clip. A beaker is then placed under the open end of the vacuum adapter in order to collect the distillate. Attach the hoses to the condenser. The hose attached to the water is connected to the lower opening of the condenser, and the spare hose is attached to the upper opening of the condenser and directed to flow into the sink. When done correctly, water should flow up the condenser and into the sink. An iron ring is used to support the heating mantle, which is moved upward to snugly cup the round bottom flask. The cord of the heating mantle is tucked under the ledge of the hood and then plugged into the outlet under the ledge, where it can be controlled by the variac dial. The distillate should drop at a rate of one drop per second. If it is dripping faster than that, as shown here, the variac dial should be turned down.